All right, let's show you guys what we brought today to the Soho market. Um, we just grabbed like a couple things from the store. Hey everyone, we have a lot going on in the store today. It's really busy. It's Labor Day weekend, so we have a little sale going on. And we have a lot of new stuff in and out of the shop right now. So a lot of cool stuff we can show you guys today. Kayla's back for a visit. So you guys are gonna see some of Kayla today and yeah, it's gonna be a good time. Hi guys, what's up? I'm back in town for the weekend. It's been a long time. I haven't been home since I moved, which has been like six, seven months. So it was time to come home, kind of like get a little break from New York. Um, so when I left, I was super nervous before going because um, I never moved away and New York is so scary. It's just like a big change from Nashville. Um, so when I moved, it was honestly, it was definitely a change. Um, I feel like I kind of like got used to it after a while. Um, I started this job when I moved, hated it, ended up quitting. Um, and then I went through a little like struggle, probably didn't have a job for like a month. So it was a little stressful. Um, and then I was like, why am I even in New York? I started like second, like guessing myself. Um, and then everything like started coming together. I ended up getting my dream job at Kith. Um, and then I got a job at Diesel and now like things are like slowly coming together. So it's been a great experience. Um, and I'm loving it so far, but I'm definitely happy to be back in Nashville for the weekend. Just have a little break from New York. And uh, yeah, just see the Red Rose team and like kind of catch up with everyone. So yeah. What's up everybody, it's Georgie here, and we got some cool new vintage in that I wanted to show you guys, if you follow me. Um, on the wall, let's take a look. The Stone Cold Steve Austin WWE team, actually the WWF, if you peep it. Crazy. Um, the back hit is nuts, look at that. Vintage Torty Def Leopard on the giant tag look at that look at the back back hit is crazy right we like that good tortillas this one's crazy this is a little nostalgic john cena what is the wwe championship t from 2010 the back hit is crazy batista that's nuts then if you come follow me towards our vintage section, you know, we've been trying to dive into more um, vintage pieces lately. Uh, so if you're interested in that, come see us. Um, a few of the things we have in right now, this is probably one of my personal favorites, the actual Batista um, WWE tee. Look at that. I'll show that. And it's young Batista too. Peep it. It's crazy. Oh, he's in like Guardians of the Galaxy now. It's crazy. Um, the Rock, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, check into the SmackDown Hotel. Can you smell what The Rock is cooking? What else? Y'all know who this is. Hardy Boys, you know the vibes. Hardy Boys, off the top rope. Uh, this is my favorite, just cause I like the cracking on the um. On the like, I don't know the words. What'd you say? Sting T. Look at that. The back hit is nuts. Um, another rock T. Hey Jabroni. No back hit, but this is a good one too. Um, let's see. What else we got? What else we got? Let's see. We got some cool racer tees. You know, those are easy essentials. Uh, some cool Harley tees as well. It's a good one. What else? Oh, this one's cool for Halloween coming up. It's kind of thrashed. Back hit, cool springs. 
what else, what else? Let's see. This one as well. The flames and everything off the bull. What is that? Is that a bull? What is that? Yeah? Cool. <laughs> I don't even know my, <laughs> I don't even know what that is. <laughs> Uh, the Taekwondo tee. I don't know if you guys do karate out there, if that's like uh, within the same realm, but maybe you want to rep it, come throw on the Taekwondo tee. Honestly, I like black tees that are like faded in the cracking in the words. Just gives it a little bit of character. Um, what else? Oh, this one's cool. God smack tour tee. Look at that, that's nuts. Long sleeve too. I love when they do like flames down the side. Harley does it a lot too. Um, Chrome does their own version of it as well. But this is a good one, I like this. Bike week, Daytona bike week. My parents actually met at Daytona bike week. So this is kind of cool um, for me. Yeah. And then let's see what else we got. This is a cool one on a Nutmeg tag, Nutmeg Mills tag. OG Lakers joint with the pinstripes. It's just such an odd shirt. Like you wouldn't expect to see a pinstripe Lakers shirt. Um, but yeah, we got a ton of new stuff in. We got a ton of new stuff in. Vintage is going crazy. So come see us at Red Bros and yeah. So I'm gonna do a little fit breakdown today. So this like vintage little Thrifted Roma jacket, just whatever. Uh, vintage chrome tank top, my favorite belt. <laughs> and then these vintage Carhartt camo pants. And then I got the SB4s on. Some light, a little Saturday, a little Saturday fit, you know? <laughs> so we did get our new hoodies in. So if you wanna cop some merch, they're on our website or available in store. Um, but we just kind of did the same thing with the hoodies. Um, they have like a flame rose sleeve design. And then we just kind of put, every hoodie has like a different pattern on it. So they're all one of ones. And yeah, the hoodie's like really thick um, quality. So yeah, it kind of gives me the same kind of quality of like a Gap, the Gap Easy hoodies. So. Very similar, but they do run oversized. So yeah, this is definitely essential for fall and winter this year, guys. Come get it. Um, we also got a lot, <laughs> blooper. We got a lot of cool new bape from Japan. So we got a new Japan guy. So we got like a lot of cool pieces. This is one of my favorites. It's like a bape Swavarsky. So it's got all the crystals bling bling and just like these kind of go together just very casual cream kind of also bling bling if you ask me and then we got a lot of red and white bape or red and black bape and then we got a lot of yellow and black bape so everybody's been trying to match the thunders um, and the red thunders so we got a bunch of stuff to match the thunders and the red thunders for everybody. Here's um, an example of a red one. But yeah, we have like a variety of all these kinds of kinds of stuff. So come pull up if you want bape. We got like 75 new pieces in for bape. So a lot of, a lot of cool new stuff. Actually, I also really like this one, this one's really cool. So if you need some bait, I think we got like the biggest selection of bait in Nashville. So pull up, got this little vintage bait piece from this guy in the UK. So for all my British fans, <laughs> just come get this one. <laughs> it's super cute. Pull up. <laughs> Today I got the Zebra Yeezy 350s. To y'all out there, stop buying on Timu, come out and check out Red Rose.
right guys, today, Tyler back at you with another sneaker review, um, or we have multiple that we wanna talk about today. The first one's gonna be the Kobe Halos. Um, these ones came out about a week ago. Uh, it's an all white Kobe. They do have the Mamba signs right here, like all through it, as far as like some details for you. Um, the traditional Kobe signature on the heel right here. And then like this carbon fiber here and here. Um, these are the halos that came out on Kobe's birthday, I believe. So rest in peace to Kobe. And uh, I would cop this shoe, especially like if I play basketball, I would definitely wear these. Um, it's just a good one to have in your collection. Next one we're gonna talk about that came out today. These are the Jordan 1 Palominos. Is that, how the, is that what they're called, guys? Is that how you say it? Palominos? Palominos. Um, it's like a tongue twister for me, I don't know why, but these came out today. It's supposed to be like the Mocha 2.0. Um, a little bit of differences though. So here they're gonna have like all black leather throughout. Uh, this is like a Nubuck or suede, but it's not as smooth as the original Mochas. And then to cap it off, they put like this gold or I don't know, it's kind of a funky color hit right here on the Nike Air. And they did not come with extra laces, which I think Jordan 1 should come with extra laces. I was kind of bummed about that. And then to compare it to Mochas, we have a pair right here. As you can see, the suede just moves nicely on the mochas on these ones it's just not as smooth to me um i think anybody that would compare these two would pick the mochas over the palomino so and then last but not least we're gonna talk about the big yellow mischief croc boots uh these are pretty crazy We've had the big red boots in store, but we never got a chance to review them. This one is a collab with Croc, so they put like these cheese holes in it. Um, they got the Croc, like you could put them in, well, you can't put these in sport mode. Um, but yeah, I mean, would you rock these or would you drop these? I don't know. I was thinking about copping a pair, not for real. I tried them on today, they're pretty fire. They do go with my outfit, but I don't think I can pull these off, but if you can, more power to you. And yeah, so that's really it for the reviews today. Make sure you guys like and subscribe at Red Rose Hype Shop on YouTube. Okay, we're gonna play Gas the Shoe Challenge. Each of us is gonna put on uh, the bait hoodie. We're gonna zip it up all the way so we can't see. And George is first, and we're gonna time it. Whoever does the best is the winner, time-wise. So we're gonna. Okay. I'm gonna start off easy. Oh my god, it's so dark in here. Are you picking a grill from down here? Hmm. Dude, my face is like squished. <laughs> Alright, you ready, Georgie? Ah. One, two, three. Okay. Oh, it's an off white, it's the Air Max 90. The wheat, uh, the wheat color, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, do I get another one? 13 seconds. No, you just are 13 seconds at 86. 86. That was good, right? Let's go. All right, guys, that kind of wraps up this episode. Um, Haven, actually, if you were wondering where she was, she is at Music City Vintage doing a Shop My Closet with them. So you guys are about to go check them out. See ya. <laughs> hey, um, so today I'm at Music City Vintage. This is Haven from Red Rose. I'm on the other side of things. This is crazy. Uh, but today I'm here to sell my closet pretty much. Um, doing this collab thing with Music City Vintage. I got two days where I'm selling a lot of my personal pieces from my closet. Um, little couple things for the guys, for the girls, you know what I'm saying? I got some shoes. 
had to get rid of some shoes. That's the hardest part I was having was getting rid of shoes. But um, but yeah, it's been pretty cool so far. Kind of slower, it's slowing down at least. Um, I've had some friends come out and show some love, which is nice. Shout out to them. Um, yeah, let me show you what I've got in here. Uh, I got this crazy Supreme jacket. Oh my god, I can't cuss. I forgot. Um, I got this Supreme. Did I say jacket? I'm a hoodie. This cool piece here. Um, I got some Rolling Stones. I got a tracksuit. Pants are over there. Uh, just some cool pieces. If you've known me for a long time, you know that this is really heartbreaking, but it's time for it to go to a new home. So yeah, if you want it, pull up and grab it. This video is probably going to be out after it, but it's fine. This is a DKNY. This is an active piece. This is really cool. I feel like sporty tops like this are super in right now. Uh, palace. This is uh, also a really hard item to part with. This is one of my favorite pieces. Hysteric Glamour, so fire. One of my favorite brands. Um, cute, like Brazil colorway moment. Fox jersey, you already know. Uh, cool Nike piece, another jersey. A lot of graphic tees, nothing. Oh, this is actually really insane. Let me show you the detail on this piece. It's got like the diamond eyes, Swarovski. It's embedded inside the tee. Super sick, Debbie Harry, Blondie. Um, and then these are some really cute like corset pieces I have in here. These are all from my personal, just have to go somewhere. Um, what else do we have? Size 38. Um, I don't know if I'll end up selling these by the time this is over because these are a little bit pricier. This is a uh, European 38. I think it's like a seven, seven and a half women. So. If I don't get these gone by the time this video is out, if you're interested, hit me up on those. Um, Louis Vuitton Murakami collab, authentic. This is a very vintage sought after piece. This is so sick. I'm actually trying to sell this for a friend. Um, but yeah, if you're also something that may not sell just because it's a, just a crazy piece. So if you're interested in this, hit me up. Um, what else do we got? Some SBs over here. Um, just really would like to get rid of these. These are beat to sh but uh, yeah. Um, some cool hats. I got some Ed Hardy, duh. Oakley, cool number. There's the, so cute. And then let's check out the pants. These are insane as well. If you've known me for a really long time, you know that these are also something that I'm having a really hard time parting with, but also one of those things where I've just gotten my wares and it's just time for it to go to a new home. I think I've actually worn this with that dare jacket probably five times. Um, some G-Star camo cargos, vintage Gap. This is a cool pair, really cool details on the back. Uh, some True Religion for the girls, very Y2K, very cute. Um, some leather goods, helmet laying, yeah, some track pants and a few other things. It's hot in here. It's really hot. Um, but we're surviving. Had lunch already and we're just hanging out. So, yeah, if you came through, because like I said, this will probably be up by the time uh, this is over. But if you came through, thank you for showing love. Come find me at the shop. Um, I might end up putting a lot of this on my Depop too. So if some of it doesn't sell, always hit me up on Instagram if you're interested. I'm always open to selling stuff for the right price. Bye! But first, I guess we could just talk about my outfit. <laughs> Can you hear me now? Uh, Alright, today, got on... Honestly, I won this hoodie in an Instagram giveaway for the free. I don't even know what brand this is. Um, the 74 T. Shout out War. The Kuji denims, yup, you see the stitching? And then the Bottegas. I realized I wore these in the last video. I'm kind of upset, but it's raining out. And then these are Amazon shades. I'm gonna be so real. But uh, Tyler freaking it today. Look at him. Yup, he in Miami, Miami. So we were in Miami. I'm still in Miami, I'm not gonna lie. No, actually, I just got off a flight this morning. I just came back from DC, visiting my uncle. Shout out him, he just turned 71 the other day, so um, 
Got a couple pieces from there. I got this Stussy, like, crochet polo joint. Kind of like Miami, freaky vibes, you know. I got these pants off of um, this man right here, Georgie, these Junior pants. He was trying to bust me for, like, 300. So I was like, you know what, bro? Let's run the 1v1 in basketball. So we played. I beat him. Got him for a steal. We, he did double or nothing. I beat him again. Got him for more of a steal. So it was mini hoop. It's mini hoop, bro. Meet me on the court right now. <laughs> All right, we're about to go play after this. So stay tuned. Um, but now to finish it off, I got the SB Pine Green Fours. Um, we did a review on these earlier. I forget which episode, but uh, definitely like uh, one of the shoes of the year. So. Uh, yeah, we're drippy. Jenny, come here. What you got on? Tell the people. Okay, okay, a little fit check, a little fit check. So I got on this vintage Dior, um, like button up, um, just like a black tank top, my chrome esque belt, my denim tears jeans. They're the ones with the rhinestones on it, and then my Dior shoes. They got a little wet today, but got the Dior on with the Dior. Oh, and I got some jewelry on today. So we got my chrome bracelets on, you know, the, the chrome ring. And then I got a little Gucci necklace I got from the shop like maybe a week ago. I got it for a hundred bucks. So I got a steal on that one. We've been mingling with the other shops meeting some new customers and clients and like handing out flyers and letting people know who we are, what we carry and where we're at. So yeah. Who are you? Okay. What, what do you do? Where are you at in Nashville? And then your fit check for the day. Okay. I don't know if my fit's up to par today, but I am Justin with Music Vintage. Uh, we're out in East Nashville, a um, little ways from Five Points. Um, we're here today at Soho doing a Sweet Ho market today, and uh, my fit's probably kind of lame. I got a bait tee, uh, I got some polo shorts, and some Tom Sachs. Uh, we chose Cozy over Hype today. Uh, this was raining here in Nashville, and uh, yeah, that's what was the vibe today. Yeah, it was a little rainy, a lot of rainy, a lot of rainy. <laughs> today. But yeah, this is Music City. They're the homies. We always send people to each other, so make sure you guys check them out. They got a YouTube too. You gotta high five it. Uh, oh, well, kind of like. Uh, uh. <laughs> okay. Hi. Cool. What is this all about? So this is Grocery Club, right? So we got the Grocery Club, which help basically help support uh, Second Heart Food Bank. Basically, by giving eight, eight meals after after each order, cool. uh, we basically try to promote healthy eating, healthy lifestyle in North Nashville. Uh, so one of the shirts is forty dollars, two for sixty. Got the bags right here, twenty dollars. Cool. We got these other shirts for forty five. Cool. For you, Miss Lady. We got a bodysuit for thirty. Okay. Well, where can uh, everybody find you guys at? We can follow the Instagram. Orange is global. That's the link. So you can support. Uh, hunger with buying their grocery club t-shirts and honestly they're very fire I would say honestly it gives me like a gallery department vibe is that what you guys were going for yeah it's fire I'm definitely gonna cop a tea I actually used to like donate my time to second harvest and like help with the cans and stuff so I, I need to find more time to go do that kind of stuff but I'll definitely be copping a tea and make sure you guys can find them at orange Orange is global and help donate to their cause. Saria from the sneaker box, Nikes, Jordans, Yeezys, used, new. Yep, and then he, he has his booth right here. Um, he brought a little taste of his sneakers, but he has way more in store, so make sure you guys follow him at the sneaker box LLC. Got anything else to say? I don't. I'm camera shy. <laughs> thanks, Jenny. Red yeah. Rose. Thanks, Syria. What's your name? My name's Terrence. Okay. Where Where can the people find you at? 
Um, they can find me at the PSV store. We're located at 100 Taylor Street, Suite 822B. Follow us on all platforms at T-H-E-P-S-V-S-T-O-R-E. Hell yeah, and tell us what you got on today, kind of what's the vibe? Um, so boom, I'm gonna start from head to toe. So I got this crochet hat from a vendor. We trade the hats because I make hats as well. Um, the vest is my friend. He got a brand called Blessed. He just had a print party at my boutique last night. So he was printing these up in real time. Um, plant something valuable. That's my brand, the PSV store. Come check us out. PSV is an acronym. Plant Something Valuable is one of the acronyms. Uh, yeah. um, I thrifted these Adidas. Uh, I, I thrifted these like maybe like eight years ago. Fire. And then the Doc Martens, um, I got at Ross for $50. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, thrifty. Yeah, yeah, for sure. For sure. For sure. Uh, yeah, cool. And then I just put it all together. Oh yeah, well it looks dope. I love the vibe. Appreciate it. Good to meet you. Thank you. I'm Jenny. Um, you'll find the video at Red Rose Hype Shop. Say this. On YouTube. All so right. yeah, Thank you can come see yourself. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. no problem. Juan Ye. What's up? Hey, what's up? What's up? Say hey to the YouTube. What's up, YouTube? Tell us a little bit about your brand, what you got on today, where people can find you. Ooh, I'm excited for this. Okay, my name is Juan Ye. I'm the owner of the Corn Streetwear. This is my brand over here. Um, what I got out today, uh, so I got my Angel Protect tee on, which is by yours truly, Decorum. And then I got on my best friend, Jeans. Okay. He got his brand called Syndicate Streetwear out of Miami, Florida. And then if we get down to the shoe, we got the AC Cold Walls, man. Okay, some ACW. You can get those on GO. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, Where can yeah, they find you? You can find me online at decorumbrand.com. I'm based out of Nashville, Tennessee, and I'm an online shop. So I'm not a brick and mortar yet, but we on the way. On the way. Yes. Only up from here. Cool. Thanks, Wanye. Thank definitely, definitely. Tell the people a little bit about what you do, who you are, and what you got on today. Uh, my name is Drew, Throwback Thursday. Uh, specialize in 90s, Y2K pop culture stuff. Uh, today I got on a Throwback Thursday t shirt. Um, it's a spoof t shirt in honor of uh, Just for Feet. With uh, on the back, it has a whole bunch of different logos. It says Throwback Thursday. And then Fire. Some Tennessee Oilers commemorative shorts. Okay. Are those, are those a reprint or are those no, that's real, these, real OG? No, these are actually, uh, we printed these. these okay, are, so you made it. Yeah, we, we designed oh, yeah, and printed that's these. That's fire. Yeah. Yeah. What you got on feet? What are uh, those? Some remake? Reebok? $20 Reebok from Marshalls. Uh -huh. And then the patchwork is done by me. And then a $10 pair of socks. Striped socks, vintage socks. Hell yeah. yeah. And where can the people find you at? Uh, 27, 21, 8th Avenue South, Throwback Thursday, located next to Bliss Homes in Nashville, Tennessee. Um, just out here in my brand, Cheese Original, with the windbreaker, because it's raining out here, so, you know. Oh, bag. okay, back A little, little detail, little you know detail what I'm saying? embroidery, uh, okay. These are just my beaters, man, uh, just some sambas. sambas. Just a beater day, because yeah. it's ugly outside. It, it is, I got soaked today, so. Um, but, you know, we just, Showing, you know, what we have, just trying to get 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 rid of our closet. Really, this is all personal. All personal stuff. Cool. Yeah, it's all personal, and um, yeah, man, it's just good to see, cause you know, here in Soho, having, you know, I, I actually invited you, yeah, and I, you I, did. I, I wanted to make sure, like, this was actually like gonna be a good turn on, and yeah, just, and it did. It's an awesome, awesome, awesome event. And oh, I think yeah. it's just bring something else to to the Soho life too. Yeah, like, you know. put more of this community Absolutely. into Soho for sure. Absolutely, they need it. Um, yeah. yeah, where can they find you at? What's your um, Instagram? So my brand is Cheese Original. Uh, as of right now, I'm actually like reconstructed, uh, but it is uh, CheeseOriginal.com. Um, and you can find us on. I mean, I'm also starting some called. Um, Home runners. Um, it's gonna be all of us, like as a team of collectors, and we just, you know, doing like an online app situation. Cool. So yeah, look out for that. Uh, you heard it here first. <laughs> the app is exclusive. Okay. But, but you guys can also find me on A New Luck, which is spelled A N O O L V C K. 
um, on any other platform too. Hell yeah. Well, thanks for inviting me. Yeah, of course. And you'll be able to see this on the Red Rose Hype Shop YouTube. So nice. Watch out for yourself. Of course. Thank yep. you, girl. Thank you. All right. Let's show you guys what we brought today to the Soho market. Um, we just grabbed like a couple things from the store. The hard thing about having events and then also trying to run the shop as well is we don't want to take too much from the store because we want to have stuff for the customers like when they come in sometimes people's first experience so we want to make sure they have a great time but also we want to bring some fire stuff here to market the brand really well um so i know today like we brought this we just got this um we would have loved to like have this at the store but it's the supreme motion logo t very fire um for all my preem heads out there and then let's see what else we got we got a whole bunch of stuff Brought some gallery, got a couple LV. This piece is cool. It's like this neighborhood Paisley piece, it's pretty dope. Just got this in. It's another cool one. This Dior T, it's for steel, 400. This shirt is probably $1,000 at the store, so it's a pretty good deal. Uh, what else we got? Let's see, some more Supreme, some Balenciaga. We've had this for a while. We have it for 650. This is probably like a $1,500 jacket. Somebody please come through and cop this. This piece is fire. It's uh, the Balenciaga campaign denim jacket with the rips on the top. Very dope. And then my favorite piece here probably is this gallery department worker jacket. This is like one of their newer drops. We got this at the gallery store in Miami. Um, it's a very dope piece. I think this retail is really high. Resale on it's crazy, but you know, come through Red Rose, try it on. If you like it, we'll work with work with you on it. So, yeah, it's a little bit of what we brought today. Yep. I'm here. I'm here with my man Nevy right here. He just got that babe tee today that he's got on. And this came from Red Rose too, just in case y'all ain't know. Got the off white. You feel me? Come with him. You already know. I don't know y'all low, but just pull up, look him yeah. up. You feel me? He cashed out today, he went to the shop, and then he also came here to support. So we appreciate the love, guys. Vengan a comprar a Red Rose. Es muy bonita la ropa que venden aquí y los zapatos. Muy buenos precios. Gracias. I come shop at Red Rose, they got good stuff here every day. They got shoes, they got, they got everything. It's nice, it's a vibe over here. Last personal cop of the day, but I got this vintage Harley racer jacket. I've been kind of looking everywhere for like one racer jacket jacket like this kind of pair with like a dress or something but yeah shout out Maylo um, I'm gonna give them the mic and yeah what's up guys this is Benji from Maylo shout out to Red Rose we out here